Hey, this is uh, Brian from, uh, you know where, quantlabs.net. Today I just wanted to give you a quick demo. Uh, there's a lot of people out there that use Excel as a front end to a lot of the trading platforms and whatnot. Uh, one of the most basic uh, functionalities people are looking for are ways to download data from somewhere like Yahoo. Obviously, it's free data. Um, I came across uh, this website here. Uh, it's a, co a Google Code uh, project, uh, Finance Data to Excel. Uh, it's an Excel add-in that enables you to download uh, data from Yahoo. So I just want to give you a brief introduction to it. Um, it's pretty easy to activate it, even if you're new to Excel. Um, there are installation instructions, which are right here. Uh, basically, what you want to do is just put your uh, download uh, from this uh, website uh, obviously under downloads it is a uh, Excel XLA file so you just want to in insert that file or drop it into your add-ins under your in installation uh, and then to use it uh, basically I'll show you how to do that right now is two steps so when you're in uh, Excel um, what you need to do is if you this is Excel 2007 um, just come under your Excel options uh, and then you'll have your add-ins uh, under here you have inactive application application add-ins so uh, traditionally on startup your uh, finance data to Excel add-in will be in this list but you need to activate it um, or enable it so you just come under Excel add-ins go and here you get your uh, available add-ins and then you just click on your finance data to Excel as here um, and let me just show you something else here uh, so obviously your active application add-ins will display in that list like that okay so under once you have an add-in that's active um, you'll get this new tab under the uh, ribbon for any active add-in. So in this case we have Y download which is the Yahoo data download uh, and uh, you should be able to do uh, your downloading. So in this case I'll just do a quick demo of get history um, and you have a variety of your start date, your frequency, monthly, daily, yearly or however you want to download. Um, you, know, you can put into whatever your cell or cell row or uh, column uh, and then you can for all your different open, high, low, all that stuff, and just do a download. There you go. Um, it's quite useful. So, um, just to do another demo, uh, single ticket, I'll just do Google. Um, same thing, boom, boom, boom. And there you go, it's all Google right there. So, that's a real simple way to download uh, Yahoo data uh, into your Excel.